Uh, the objective of the Play to Grow Parenting Project is to increase education and support of parents to foster social emotional learning skills, early literacy and numerous skills which are very important in pre-primary learning for the children aged three to six years. The major challenges that uh, parents are facing in, in Dar es Salaam are most of the parents uh, lack ways to discipline their children in a very positive way which will help a child learn and be responsible for his or her own behavior. Uh, the Right to Play organization have been doing different activities which helps parents to overcome the challenges that they're facing. Uh, the organization have been uh, training the parent educators who are the ones providing the education to the parents in the selected partner schools. Uh, some of the examples of feedback that I've received from the parents who have been engaged into the Play to Grow Parenting project uh, that they have changed their attitude towards the use of corporal punishment. That is not the best way of disciplining their children. Instead, they are using setting limit and giving choices and setting routine for their children. Also, they have got skills whereby they are able to identify their children's emotions and be able to respond towards those emotions. I have received the feedback from parents that they have got new ways or technique of managing stress and managing conflict among the family and neighborhood. Some other parents have uh, changed the way they have been behaving towards their children like they were so harsh and so aggressive all the time, but now they, they have strengthened their relationship with their children. The children are free to talk to them, to play to them. So there is the home environment is so friendly for a child to be staying at home.